That's a recording. You don't have to get back. I had a very surprise, a great honor. Some friends of mine, a couple, heterosexual couple, who are Jehovah Witnesses, are celebrating their 50th anniversary. And her side of the family was planning a picnic in the park. Uh, and people, they've ch changed that, and at 6 o'clock they have the graduation of their granddaughter from school. So they decided they would just go out to lunch together. So I said, why don't you come over here, visit with me, and have lunch with me. So my house was an utter mess. I'm going to give you a real quick tour and show you what we managed, the illusions we managed to create. So just keep it following me. First, we put some of these on the door so they'd know what we were celebrating there. I always have this up all the time. And uh, I'm going to turn off the TVs now. And I put on my love hat. You know, this is the, I managed to get this area, you can just glance down there. And then come into this room, coming this way. No, just keep it, just keep it, get, get back so you get it all. So come on in. This is essentially just about ready. So what we did is we bought, come over here. I bought a happy 50th anniversary cake, which we picked up this morning, Devil's Food. You know, and I have these, these heart plates for uh, uh, putting it on. And we're thinking of, if they like this plate, when I take this one off, I'm going to give this flow blue plate to them as a gift if they, if they like it. And then I have here the heart mats and three heart plates. You know, one, one for each of them because they're very single-minded and the multiple one for me. And I have heart mats. Which we were gonna go out and get some. We're gonna go. We're gonna go out and get some food at this place where you pick your own. Because George is a vegetarian, and I not don't know what his wife's tastes are. So instead of they have to leave here within three or four hours. So instead of going involved with a restaurant, they, his wife has never visited here. George knows me well. George, as a matter of fact, did this wonderful painting. He was the. He was the. A person that he was the one that that one on the roll of right that's him and his he can practice law as John Woodward who he was the jailhouse wife of John Woodward John Woodward's real wife is on the left his first one who he had children with and who has eaten the one on the top right is a trans person that he robbed the bank to finance the sex exchange operation and George worked on that painting and I paid him, you know, I, I bought it for him, I'll have him reproduce so he can sell them at fairs. And over here, I have various things like pictures that he made, and I'm going to make for him, but I don't, and my printer isn't working, but this is him with, when he was younger. This is him when he was younger with John Waterwitz, who was his, now he's heterosexual, but they had a show in Lincoln Center, and this was a, Resnick, I think her name was, a picture she had taken of him, but look at him, the whole picture, the important thing. There he is today, and there he is as a young man who had grown breasts because he liked them. This is Liz Eden, the person who you saw in the, with the breast up in the other picture, and this is, uh, this is how my printer was printing. I can't print that way anymore. So they are going to be, uh, and these are articles that they may not have seen in the, in the New York Post. His wife may not see. I don't know how much she's into the. Uh, I'll give them one of those if they want to have an extra. Uh, they just quoted me. I mean, it got all kinds of reviews. It's available on Amazon. Now, I got them a few gifts. I have a Je Jehovah is my God mug in there, and uh, I'm going to offer them, you know, various little items, and uh, uh, so. Now, so, but I want you to know the price of what I did to make this house look like somebody, some, some decent person lived here. I'm a recovering hoarder, and it's hard for a recovering hoarder to create. This looks almost civilized. I mean, you think, you think it's civilized, right? It's a big fraud. What, how many minutes are we up to? How many minutes? Just tell me. Forty. No. Oh, four minutes. And okay, so follow me. Uh -huh. 
So I want this one possibly so they can come in here and I can show them something on my TV, some videos that I shot or some videos that George is in. They're all here in my video. I have two chairs, so I'll be able to sit here and show them that. So this room is sort of accessible. So back up. <laughs> you don't have to worry about keeping it even. I mean, just don't fall. But I paid a price. See, this is the secret. Aha! Nice housekeeping. Good housekeeping. Is that the way? When I have to take a shower? You know, you know what I'm going to go through tomorrow to take a shower? <laughs> and the toilet handle is tied till it works, but you know, you got to hold it in or else it'll break. I got to warn them about that. Uh, I've got to clean that out before we get we leave here. That will do after we shot the video. Aha! Uh -huh. So we've seen one hidden mess. Now we'll see one of the other hidden messes. Aha! Uh -huh. Don't have anything else today. Any pictures on the wall? I'm mainly at the bed. Mainly at the bed. Now, when I go to sleep, when I want to lay down tonight, when I try, I come home I'm exhausted from filming Brendan Fay at the uh, Catholic Worker from 7 to 9 or whatever. I better have this cleared off because I'll be so tired when I come home here. You know, uh, you can film just some of the up high, high, go high. High, up high, no, over here on the side. You can film, you know, the things I have hanging on the chains, just right. film the chains. Right. You know, you don't have to make it a long thing. I am, I'm going all the okay. way around. Okay, just high, don't have any of the, okay, okay, and then, see this mess here, you go down here, see this is, this is, this is my bedroom. Do you know what it's like? I am gonna, you'll probably read about me dying in some, in some accident, falling over, as you see that here, that Senator Reed had an exercise machine. I have an exercise machine that's a turb, I, I don't know if you noticed it. Uh, anyway, kind of real quick, keep it on the floor. Watch out where you walk. <laughs> this thing here is one of those things that you step on. Come over here, I'll take it. This is one of those turbo chargers. You step on it and you pull the handles. Well, Harry, Harry Reed, see if we almost fell over that. Harry Reed put his eye out for exercise. No, so I, I haven't even used it. It's a great machine. But I once had, did have in here, a this exercise machine, which is a bike. I've got to pick this up and put that back in and find somewhere to get rid of my exercise machine. So I can barely walk through my hall. This used to be here underneath all these scarves and hats and all this stuff. I mean, my entrance, this is going to be returned another, th I, re I couldn't resist buying, 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 buying. You know, it's all about stuff in our society. And uh, so anyway, folks, uh, uh, you know, I managed, you know, I do have certain things like showcases of, uh, of ornaments and arms that I built. And they're very religious, so I have my Pope, my Pope thing from Bernadette, and I have the Jesus clock that doesn't work, and this is my call my transsexual Jesus Mary picture, because all my friends are trans. I have Marsha P. Johnson, you know, victim of hate. And this were pictures done by this artist, artist at the Figment Festival, which I missed this year. And uh, I think uh, he's an artist, so, you know, I'm going to offer one of three sewing machines. I have his 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 mother had this ancient thing. It, it's a golden, golden. <laughs> I can't get the top off. But anyway, it's a real antique. Uh, but I had two other machines that I can't use. And I've got to straighten up this. But anyway, I'm doing my best. I put up. Oh, this is a thing from Haiti, which I'm I'm thinking of replacing the cupid with. I'm gonna put it right down here uh, because. This is a symbol of freedom of the slaves in Haiti, and I got it as a carving there, and I really loved it. And you know, Lavar, I mean, they are African American, so I want them to know how there have been very important people in my life who were African American. And I guess that's about all there is for now. I want to, can I put you in there? That's how, how hard I, we started at what time this morning? We started at 8 o'clock, and it was horrible. <laughs> It's going on four hours. They're here, due here in 15 oh. minutes. 
So I will tell you later. I'm ready for a drink. <laughs> not on the job. Not during working hours, my friend. <laughs>